something very different. So we we go from uh, non-fiction handbooks to fiction, and uh, uh, namely uh, books for children, which is a huge, a huge market today, and especially here in UK. If you if, if, if you bump into a UK bookshop, you see that you know the, the children's section you know, are growing and growing and growing. So uh, we have here Pro Edi Joy Edizioni, which is a small Italian children's book publisher. And please tell us your story. Well, uh, after the big uh, the big ones of the market, it comes to me to explain you uh, the world of small publishers. I'm Lorenzo, uh, of, uh, I'm 16 years old and I'm here uh, because of a school project. So today I'm going to explain you who we are and what we do. Uh, Tomale Vigio Edizioni is specialized in children's books, uh, especially in illustrated children's books. We have two brands, uh, Tomolo and Enijo. Tomolo is the one that we created uh, five years ago. And then there's Eddie Joe, uh, which was on the market um, since uh, I mean it, it's 15 years old, so uh, it's pretty it's pretty old uh, this brand. Uh, our children's book series are intended to teach about values like love, friendship, respect, and uh, also inclusion. Uh, we try to uh, put in our children's book messages uh, that can be delivered to every single. Uh, the person that reads it. Uh, as you can see, we get in touch with other cultures like uh, uh, Georgian. Well, this is this is this one is of our my favorite books. Uh, well, the, 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 the interesting thing is that if you if you travel around London these days, especially if you take the tube, you will notice that there are these you know big advertising about these new media version in theaters, which is. Which says goes as say uh, after after Euripides after Rassan here in London they made a new a new updated version of Medea. So this this book from 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 yours you know says that it's it's really timely timely you know presented here here in London, which is a very say inclusive inclusive story from the ancient Greek uh, you know drama and and Greek theatre. Yeah, uh, for this reason. Uh for this reason, we made uh, a book which is in uh, Italian, ancient Greek, and Georgian, uh, because we we like other cultures and we like to uh, we like inclusion. We believe uh, in the inclusion uh, uh, with books, uh, made with books. So we try to expand ourselves in uh, every single uh, field possible. Uh, we have books in uh, Japanese, and, uh, in Russian, in English. French, Spanish, and many other languages, um, because uh, well, uh, we believe that culture uh, can be delivered uh, also um, with bilingual books, uh, not only with uh, with classic books. Uh, we offer uh, a series of English books and bilingual books, um, and I want to talk to you about um, first thing first, media. Uh, the woman after, uh, before the mic. Uh, we all know uh, the version of Medea uh, by Euripide, uh, in which she kills uh, her sons. But we, uh, what we do not know is that there are other versions of the same uh, story. Uh, this one in particular uh, was told us by the the, the person uh, Tamar uh, who translated the book in uh, Georgian. Uh, in which uh, Medea didn't kill her um, her son, her sons, uh, but she is the founder of the, of the medicine, because the word medicine comes from uh, the same uh, um, word that uh, is the, the name Medea. Uh, so there's a, a connection between these two these two terms, these two names. Uh, it's also in ancient Greek. It was translated by my ancient Greek professor. Uh, I, I'm really proud of this book because um, it was of my mother's dream to have uh, a book in ancient Greek and uh, uh, it's one of our most important projects uh, and when we, know, when we knew that uh, all London is, uh, 
is, uh, I mean, is covered by this uh, advertising yeah. about media. Uh, we were, well, uh, it's, it, it's pretty cool. Uh, it's, uh, it's the perfect city for us in this period. So we decided to bring uh, to you this book also for this reason. Uh, this precious book takes uh, the reader back to the ancient Colchis and Greece through delicate watercolors illustrations uh, and the translation into Georgian. Uh, we say, we, you may be wondering why uh, did we translate it also in, um, in Georgian. That's because in, the, um, uh, in this period, Greeks weren't only in Greece, they were uh, also in Turkey, they were also in Georgia. Uh, in which uh, they probably spoke both Greek, ancient Greek, and um, another type of Proto-Georgian, uh, probably. Uh, so there's well, a the Armenian, the old Armenian language. Exactly. Uh, so there's probably a connection between Medea and yeah. the Georgian language, uh, and we wanted also to uh, make something for the lot of Georgian people who come in Italy for better work experience because. Um, there are a lot of people that come directly from Georgia uh, to Italy. Well, and again, uh, uh, since what's happening in the in the say uh, Middle East region, and also the you know the the, 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 the uprising in Tbilisi streets a couple of weeks ago, I guess you know the focus of Georgia is is again very you know very 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 timely. So there's a lot of uh, interest in the international community of you know. But Georgia, in this small country between the Black Sea and the Caspian Sea, and so the, you know, your your this new your new publication you are you know featuring here the London Book Fair is I think it's quite you know, it's quite uh, timely and it's, it's, it's a great time to to be here for you with this with your publication. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, uh, and uh, I see you you also brought some others. Well, to showcase. We have another book of the same illustrator, uh, which is here, uh, the Princess of the Moon Princess, uh, which is a traditional Japanese uh, legend. Uh, we do not have it, uh, it here to display to you. Uh, I'm sorry for this, but uh, on the plane you don't have you don't have too much space uh, available. Um, so I'm just displaying it to you uh, by this PowerPoint. Uh, the Moon Princess is a famous Japanese fairy tale uh, which details of uh, which details the life of uh, Kaguya Hime, the princess of the moon who discovered uh, who is discovered as a baby inside a stalk of glowing pattern paint. Uh, this is very peculiar uh, as media because the illustrator uh, took her time took her time to study the the piece of clothing of the uh, ancient Japan. Uh, in order to make something historically accurate. Uh, so behind those kind of books, uh, which are between our two book series, Tomo uh, Legende, uh, which is about legends and folklore, uh, and Tomo International about languages, uh, there's a, a big study of the history and of the, uh, the traditions and everything that concerns the uh, ancient populations. Uh, that's uh, in, uh, in bilingual in Italian Japanese, uh, and it was translated with a, uh, a girl that came uh, to, uh, that started working for us for a short amount of time uh, okay. that came from the, directly from the university. And that's one of uh, the examples of our illustrated books for children. Uh, because the other ones that I displayed you uh, can be read also by adults because um, uh, we like to make books that uh, are not only for children uh, but can be read uh, by everyone, can be read, sorry. Well, uh, also 90% of book children are read by their parents to the, to the children exactly. for going to bed. So it's important we also focus on the uh, other side of the children's book. Exactly, so we thought, why uh, couldn't we make some books that can be read also by the parents themselves, uh, even if they do not read uh, always them to their children? Uh, that can be read as, as a parent of two kids, I always read a children book first before buying it. So see, if I like it, then I will buy it from my children. So this is something very, you know, very, very interesting. You're doing that. This attention to the 
to the to the market. Uh, thank you very much. So um, and again, I mean, this has been it's a small small company. It's a very young company, but they they do interesting many interesting things. These bilingual editions have been uh, uh, something very peculiar. Uh, the media book, I think, is very it's you know it's it's very something in the news here in the London market. So. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, I really hope that we will uh, uh, that our hard work will uh, uh, will give results in the future because well, market doesn't show mercy, so you have uh, to put in your effort. Uh, so you have to be the first or the best. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Good luck. Thank you very much. Uh, Thank you.